Hi everyone. So today is crazy because I found my old YouTube channel I used when I was like 16 years old and I just wanted to share the videos I made today. My old channel I made when I was like 16, my voice sounded different, I made different videos. It was different. The graphics are also different in the video obviously. So yeah, I just wanted to share a video today of a realistic role play I did and I just think it's really interesting and I would love to show you guys what I did so yeah let's get started hi everyone welcome back to another episode of my life today I'll be riding my pony for the last time and in case you do not know who I am talking about I am referring to my black Welsh mountain pony named Raven, who which I have been trying to sell for a while now since I feel as though we can find a much more stimulating home somewhere else. Therefore, I placed him up for sale and went through quite a couple of interviews and meetings until I finally found him a suitable owner. Of course, it's always a sad time to let a horse go to a new place, but I truly believe that Raven is better off with a new home. After all, Raven is used for the basic lessons I teach to young riders, so if not ridden, then he is always in the pasture. And Raven was raised to be in pony racing competitions, so clearly he isn't at a proper home with me, and he would be much more happy and alive somewhere else. And as I always say, it's no fair when a horse is stuck doing riding they don't like, so I'm glad I finally found a person who will fit Raven's needs. But instead of just throwing Raven off to his new owner, I have decided that for our last day together, it'd be great to actually go for a fun ride at Fergrove after all of these years of Raven not living his life to the fullest. Then, I'll trailer him away to his new home. So, let's begin. Okay everyone, we are now here at Fir Grove. But before I hop on Raven, I have to groom him off and get him tacked up. As always, I first use my curry comb to pull up any dirt and loose furs. Then, I pick up my dandy brush and use it for as long as I feel is needed for Raven's coat. And of course, we can't forget the hoof pick for his hooves. So like normal, I now will simply pick out any dirt or any matter that has wound up on his feet. Now with Raven cleaned off, it's time to get tacked up. So first, I will place on Raven's saddle pad. This saddle pad I actually really like too, so I'm excited to use it today since I just bought it recently. Anyway, next is the saddle. But I'm only going to tighten the saddle's girth a little until before we begin our ride, just so that Raven has time to adjust to the fit. Okay everyone, with that complete, I will now go lead out Raven, tighten his girth, get my helmet on, and then finally begin our ride. Now that I'm on Raven, I could already tell that he's excited for today. I mean, he must know something is up, since I haven't ridden him in years. But before we begin the ride I have been planning for today, we have to warm up. Except, this will be relaxing since our warm up will just be a trail ride down to our destination of today's actual riding session. Therefore, it really should be peaceful and very scenic.
We've now reached our official riding location for today, and what I've had planned for I and Raven's actual ride is probably going to be quite nostalgic, since when I was riding Raven consistently for pony competitions when I was younger, we'd visit the spot all the time to practice on our speed and stamina. But today, it's not about speed or anything. It's just going to be about enjoying our last gallop together before Raven heads off to the next chapter of his life. Therefore, without further ado, let's get riding. Okay, everybody, that was I and Raven's last gallop together. I will miss Raven, and days like this always make me question why I even bothered wanting to sell, but I know Raven will be happier at his new home, and I'm sure he'll miss me. Except, as the amazing Brendan Yuri has sang before, if you love me, let me go, and I certainly need to let Raven go for him to actually live his life to the fullest. Therefore, this was meant to happen, and I hope Raven has nothing but the best at his new home, because I certainly wish I could have provided that. So with that said, goodbye Raven, you were a good friend to me, and I'll cherish every memory and skill I've gained from you. But it's time for us to move on. Bye buddy, I'll miss you and your quirks. Except your future home holds something much brighter and more made for you. And all I want is for you to be happy.